hello to GYAS how are you I hope you are doing well <coughs> so friends as you know that on our channel we are covering the syllabus of UPSC civil services and for that purpose we have started multiple series on our channel that are prelims oriented as well as mains oriented so currently we have six series that are focused on your prelims and one series that is focused on your mains so uh, and in this in this series and in this video we will talk about our main series so friends what we do in main series we daily give you three questions that are that are two from current perspective and one from main uh, pr uh, there are two one from static perspective so daily three questions are given to you and uh, you give the answers to us and we evaluate these question uh, answers and uh, give, provide you feedback so this is what is done basically by us in in this series so friends uh, today is sunday so as you know that on sundays we 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 keep revision test so today is the first revision test and we will give you 10 questions in it so currently in this video i am providing only six questions that uh, that is that are from current point of view and four questions that are from static point of view they will be uploaded in the second video so let's see what are the questions of uh, the revision test of today uh, the first question is uh, it is said that India's commercial surrogacy industry is worth 2.3 billion dollar but the exploitation faced by surrogates necessitated its regulation. However, to the extent of making surrogacy altruistic has rendered women mere an agency of exploitative family relations that she has long faced in the name of Indian family ethos. So you have to comment on this question friends uh, and uh, the word limit is 250 and uh, the maximum marks allotted are 15. So you might uh, might might say that sir, these questions are too tough to be attempted but I have deliberately kept them uh, kept their wording tough so that so that to make you prepare for the for the coming coming uh, challenges that you will face in the exam itself because friends in the exam the exam hall the total environment will be totally different so in for that purpose you must be prepared to face the tough tough statements so next question is second second question is if india's shortcomings are to be countered after its independence extremely low penetration of social security net can be said as the as one of the most prominent one so suggest suitable measures to end this menace so friends uh, there is there is a lot of uh, talk about uh, the poor uh, poor penetration of social security net in india so you have to comment uh, com uh, you have to not comment you have to suggest the measures and uh, and the the word limit is 250 and the marks allotted are 15 so the third question is india's banking system is facing its worst of times it holds the key to india's takeoff as a major power in coming decades quick fixes are not the solution what is your take on this so friends you have to tell your opinion on this and uh, you have to out you if you are uh, uh, telling your opinion then I, then also you have to uh, tell about uh, what are the suitable measures that could be taken so the word limit is 250 and the marks are 15 now let next comes the fourth question fourth question is the depleting groundwater resources of india is a major area of concern which has the potential to cage india's already staggering growth story comment so friends you have to write this answer in 150 words and the marks allotted are 10 marks so as you know that uh, groundwater uh, resources are depleting in india so they are becoming a, uh, becoming a cause of concern because groundwater you know that it is uh, it, it, uh, the, on, on groundwater it is the most important source of uh, drinking water in india so also it is also the source of uh, ag uh, uh, irrigation in case of agriculture so 49 percent of india's population is engaged in agriculture and if the, the groundwater is depleting then the livelihoods will be in danger so there are multiple challenges that we will face as a result of depleting of groundwater resources so you have to tell about those sources and you have to also at the end you have to in conclusion you can tell about the steps that we can take to 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 address this situation the fifth question is the recent 10 percent quota in government jobs for economically weaker sections is raising new questions and is not the answer to india's rising unemployment levels do you agree with it analyze so friends here you have been given the uh, the kind of uh, room to explain your view on it so if you agree with it then uh, then uh, then uh, you have to give your answer and if you doesn't agree then also you have to tell tell your why that why you don't agree so the words word limit is 250 and the marks 
uh, allocated are 15. The sixth question is the tenets of US foreign policy are viewing an overhaul under the Donald Trump's administration and India must be prepared to deal with the situation it will lead to. So friends you have to discuss it as you know that Donald Trump is uh, Trump's administration is allergic to uh, multilateralism and as well as the, the present global regime that is that is guided by uh, by by almost we can say uh, uh, 50 60 years of uh, of l uh, long long uh uh, period after the after the after the end of the world war two so that the donald trump administration is completely overhauling this this foreign policy uh, which which on which the us us uh, 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 kind of uh, uh, us us made made progress in last 60 or 60 or 70 years so you have to suggest that uh, uh, that india must be prepared to deal with this situation so you have to discuss this and the word words are 250 and the marks are 15 marks so friends you can uh, see here that the uh, currently the total test becomes of first question is of 15 second is also 15 third is also 15 and uh, it becomes 45 marks and then then the fourth question is of 10 marks it it becomes then it becomes 55 and after that it, it becomes uh, 70 70 and 85 and uh, more four questions will be given to you uh, in a in a in a in a, in a time gap of two hours so first of all write about these these answers so then you will also get the static answers so friends let me explain in detail what is the basically initiative uh, so for those students who are seeing the video for the first time so friends it is an initiative in which we get daily cover three questions and out of these two are two uh, two are current oriented and one is static oriented so we daily give you three questions so these three questions are of UPSC mains level and you have to write answers and send uh, you have to send us to it uh, you, you have to send these answers to us on our whatsapp number that is 89684264814 so friends the issue that the the major issue the students face is of evaluation because there are a lot of platforms that that cover that cover your uh, uh, question part that get that give you questions but the answers are not evaluated so the basic problem is the evaluation because then only you will get that idea then only we will get the idea that where you are lacking and where what are your plus points and where you have to improve so the evaluation is the major issue and we are addressing this issue and we will provide you feedback proper feedback and also we will provide the uh, points and tips uh, to you uh, so that you can improve your answer writing skills so relevant material will also be given to you uh, relating to these questions that we will cover in in uh, in daily in daily main answer writing series so these this relevant material will be given to you on sundays so friends uh, some students say that uh, sir we don't know where from where to write the answer of this question because have we haven't read much about this so in that case we will solve your problem and you will get the proper relevant material on sundays and that thus you can enrich your ideas of the topic and next uh, lastly friends uh, that uh, there, 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 there will be a revision test on Sundays uh, as today's first revision test and it will be based on 10 questions that is 6 from current topic and 4, uh, four from static topic so let me tell you friends that as, as we are putting lot of efforts we have kept a minimum fee structure for this initiative it is 1000 per month that is if you want to subscribe to it for uh, for one month for example January month then you will have to uh, deposit an amount of 1000 per month but in case you want to subscribe to this initiative in a package format then you will be uh, you will be getting this this uh, package in rupees 3200 that is we are offering a discount of 800 otherwise it would have amounted to 4000 rupees but we are offering a discount of 800 on four months package but in case you want to subscribe it for three months that is January to March then we are giving you this uh, this complete package in 2700 at a discount of rupees 300 so if you want to subscribe to this initiative you can do whatsapp us at this given number that is 89684264814 so friends this is all about today's video if you liked it please like it share it and please if you like the questions Please do tell me in the comment box and and uh, do uh, do share with your friends and also friends please subscribe to our channel and do not forget to press the bell icon because then only you will get all the notifications of the important updates that we do on our YouTube channel relating to the UPSC CSE 2019. So thank you friends, thank you very much.